So last lesson, you were writing your description of Fagin's room and you saw that video as well. So I hope you enjoyed that lesson. Today we are going to move on to pages 10 and we're going to read halfway down page 11 and then you're going to carry on with the lesson. Oliver awoke the next morning to find the boys gone and Fagin gloating over a box of jewels and gold. When he realised that Oliver was watching him, Fagin seized a knife and questioned him angrily. Just then, Nancy came in. She was the girlfriend of Fagin's partner, Bill Sykes. Oliver liked her at once. Then the Dodger came back from work. He brought more silk handkerchiefs and a fine leather wallet. Fagin, the Dodger, and a boy called Charles Bates began a game that Oliver thought very funny. Fagin hid things in his pockets and the boys tried to take them out again without his noticing. Oliver still didn't know what work the boys did, but he longed to go with them. One day, he did. The Dodger and Charlie walked so slowly, Oliver feared they would be late. Then they stopped altogether by a bookstore. Suddenly, the Dodger plunged his hand into an old gentleman's pocket and ran off. All at once, Oliver realised the boys were pickpockets. At the same moment, the old gentleman, whose name was Mr Brownlow, noticed his loss. Seeing Oliver, he began to run after him. Soon, everyone in the street had left their business and joined in the chase. Oliver was caught and taken before the magistrate. Mr Fang, the magistrate, a stern man, thought Oliver deserved three months hard labour. But then the bookstall owner arrived and told the true story. Mr Fang discharged Oliver. A few moments later, Mr Brownlow passed him in the street, shivering from fever and shock. The old gentleman felt very sorry for Oliver. He lifted him into his arms and took him home. Oliver was ill for weeks. Mrs Bedwin, Mr Brownlow's housekeeper, nursed him tenderly. Above his head hung a portrait of a young woman. Mr Brownlow was struck by how like her Oliver looked. We're going to stop there for today and you can focus on the lesson plans.